that if you're going to take ashwagandha, I recommend not taking it for longer than a month and a half as they did in this study. In fact, I would suggest that you only take ashwagandha around periods of kind of moderate to extreme stress. What's moderate, what's extreme is going to depend on what you're going through. Only you know how much stress and life events you can tolerate. So well then buffering stress with ashwagandha, buffering cortisol in the afternoon and evening can be very beneficial for you. But then I would say after about um, 30 days maximum, I would take at least two to four weeks off. Two weeks is probably enough, but four weeks off because you don't want to chronically buffer cortisol. It's just not a good idea.